The Miami Dolphins will enter the 2023 season to make sure everyone knows that Tua Tagovailoa is the starting quarterback. Chris Greer and Mike McDaniel have confirmed it, but the media has not yet believed it to be true. The media is Tua Tagovailoa's enemy since he came to South Florida, they still bring up rumors and suspicions around Tua. Well it is a fact that everything Tua has done this season has not been recognized by the media, an emotional season for Dolphins fans, the culmination of a five-game winning streak in which Tua Tagovailoa led the league in passer ratings and pro bowl votes. Then there were the lows of Tagovailoa's concussions and ending the regular season losing five of the last six games, Tagovailoa's health is the first story this season. The Dolphins won 9-8 even though he missed four starts and was on track to advance to the knockout stages with a quarterback in their third streak. When Tagovailoa was fit and active, the foul was one of the best in the league. Tyreek Hill and Jalen Waddell have made up one of the best wide-gathering duos in league history despite being inconsistent in midfield. It's not hard to imagine how much better the season could be if Tagovailoa were available year-round which is why the main office needs to decide whether to continue with Tagovailoa or move in a different direction. There would be many options to replace Tagovailoa if the Dolphins chose to do so. The freelance market includes Tom Brady of Tampa Bay and Jimmy Garoppolo of San Francisco, while Derek Carr of Las Vegas can be purchased through commerce. May 3rd is the deadline for the Dolphins to choose Tagovailoa's fifth-year option. It looks like all the rumors about Tom Brady will soon be over as he has made his most recent career decisions. Obviously he wants to be somewhere competitive and have a chance to win a championship. But he should wake up when he's 45 years old. Tom Brady used to be GOAT, but now he's just someone who used to be GOAT. The Miami Dolphins need to realize this, Tom Brady was almost to the Miami Dolphins in the 2022 season but that was destroyed by Brian Flores. Brady is older and his arms are not as strong as they used to be. And there is no reason to think Miami should replace Tua Tagovailoa with him even though he has a very good relationship with Miami Dolphins owner Stephen Ross. On Monday, both Chris Greer and Mike McDaniel said that Tua is expected to start in 2023. This means Brady won't be going to the Miami Dolphins, it's over. The 2022 season may or may not be the last for Tom Brady but it looks like it will be his last in Tampa Bay. For Brady, his season hasn't been so bad. He still throws more than 4. 0, 0, 0 yards and 25 touchdowns but his accuracy has dwindled and his arm strength isn't what it used to be, according to the latest news we received Brady will be coming to the Las Vegas Raiders next season. The Raiders are a team he could land on due to his connection to Josh McDaniels, a blockbuster signing that is about to be announced a contract won for GOAT worth up to $100 million, and the terms are extremely attractive, there is no reason for Brady to refuse, the contract will be announced next March. Let's wait together.